Hello everyone, hope you are doing good and safe at home. And before we start the activity for today, there are a few things that I'd like to let you know. The first thing is, whatever you're going through right now, just want to let you know, don't be hard on yourself. And also, our human mind has a tendency to make us feel that we are alone in whatever that we are feeling or going through. But just a reminder to all of us right now that whatever we are going through, that we are all in it together. There was a post that I read yesterday which I felt was relevant to all of us and this is what it says. It's okay to not know how to homeschool your own child, to not know how to work from home, to give kids more screen time than usual, to make a colorful daily schedule or just wing it, to not magically feel motivated to work out at home or take on a new hobby, to not feel okay. This is not normal for any of us. Please be kind to yourself. The activity that we have in store for you today is called Draw Your Breath. This activity will help you to relax and bring your focus back to the present moment. So before we start, there are just a few things. Uh, find a quiet place in your home, away from the hustle and bustle, the TV, the radio, and also put your phone on silent mode or keep it away from you. So what you need for this activity are simple things. So um, A4 white paper and if you don't have that even a whistle board is fine. And you can either use crayons, uh, watercolors, felt pens or color pencils. So whichever medium that you prefer is fine. So for me I prefer to work with uh, watercolors today. So what we need to do before we start this activity is we are first going to create a background image. So you can use your medium of choice to do this. All you have to do is just fill in colors and just paint a background. And once we have that done, I'll explain the next step. So you can start together, you can take out whatever medium you like to use and just start painting or coloring and once you are done we'll move to the next step So as you're creating your background, a few things to keep in mind again, to not worry about what you're doing. So don't let this become uh, something that stresses you out. But the main thing is to focus on the process and not on your outcome. So it's all about expressing yourself, it's all about just going with the flow. So whatever color, colors that you're attracted to right now, just go with it and just allow yourself to just go with the flow. So just spend some time coloring, don't rush, and that too will be a huge stress reliever for you. So now we're done with the background and if watercolors was your medium of choice 
then you'll have to give it about 20 to 30 minutes until it's completely dry and then once it's dry we can start with the next step so now we're going to move into the next step and for this what you need once again is either one crayon or felt pen or color pencil so I chose a crayon so what we're going to do now is I'm going to take you through a relaxation exercise a slight a small breathing in and breathing out and then I'll lead you through the activity so what I'm going to ask you to do is to sit if you're seated on a chair to sit with your back against the chair or if you're seated on the floor to sit uh, with your back straight and to sit in a comfortable position and to close your eyes and then I'll take you with a few steps of breathing in and out and then I'm going to ask you to pick up either your crayon, your color pencil or your felt pen and to allow your breath to take your color pencil, your crayon or your felt pen for a walk on your paper. So at first this might sound a bit complicated but as you go in with the flow it will just begin to flow. So initially you'll be very conscious about what you're doing but as you go on I want to encourage you to focus on your breath and not on what you're drawing. So we'll start. So we'll sit comfortably and you can pick up either your color pencil, your crayon or your felt pen and once you're ready you can close your eyes so we we'll do it together so we'll take at the count of four we'll take a deep breath in and at the count of four we'll take the big deep breath out so we'll breathe in one two Now while your eyes continue to remain closed, you can pick up your crayon, color pencil, your felt pen and continue to focus on your breath and allow your breath to take this color pencil, your crayon or your felt pen for a walk on your paper. So you don't need to draw out an image but it, you're basically drawing out the shape of your breath. So while our eyes are closed, you continue to do it. So you focus on your breathing in and your breathing out. Remind ourselves again, breathe in and breathe out. Breathe in and breathe out.
and slowly bring it to an end. And when you are ready, you can open your eyes. So this is what my draw your breath drawing is like. We'd like to hear from you what it was like for you, what, what the process was like for you. Uh, you can send us images of what it was like. You can either post it, post it on the thread or send it to us privately. And also let us know what this was like for you. We'd like to hear your feedback and know if this was helpful for you. And also, if there are those of you who would like support during this time, you can get in touch with us. You can contact us via Facebook, Instagram, or the Art Therapy Hotline, or by email. So until next time, stay safe and take care.